Have you ever wanted a boost gauge? Or do you have one maybe? Laying in your closet, ready to install, but you're not sure how? Today I'll show you the best way and the easiest way to install a boost gauge in a 2001 to a 2004 LB7 Duramax. I'll start here under the hood. So the simplest way to do this is just to take this little hose here that connects to the wastegate for the turbo. Take that hose and somewhere in between it install a little fitting and then you've got your pressure line for the boost gauge. Put it through the firewall. Also, if you want a little more boost than you should probably have, just put a bolt in this end of this hose like I did. It still reads accurate. Everything's fine there. But that way, your actuator won't open at all and you will have max boost. <laughs> now inside the cab, I've mounted my boost gauge underneath the dash here which is a phenomenal spot if you don't want to see it there you've got your pressure line coming through the firewall two wires coming off the back to light it up one is a ground so you just hook that onto the frame here anywhere will be fine and one is the power i have mine hooked up here in the fuse box to the ignition that way anytime you turn the ignition on your gauge will light up like so. A better idea might even to hook it up to the fuse for your lights, your headlights. That way anytime that sensor automatically turns the lights on, that uh, light on the boost gauge will light up as well. I'll show you how responsive the gauge is hooked up to that spot. Like it moves up and down fast, no problems. It reads perfectly accurate. Might as well show you here how much boost a stock LB7 will push with that uh, actuator hose taken right off of the actuator. So this is just max boost that it can do stock. 